Hi, and welcome to episode number five of Coffee with Tommy. As you can see, it hasn't been a very good week. I went skateboarding this week, and uh, the result did not turn out so well. But before we get into that, I want to give a couple thanks. First, to my neighbor Sharon. If you can see this mug, it's got a whole bunch of bears humping each other. I like different kinds of mugs. Wink, hint, hint. If you have new mugs for me, send them in. I like to use them. And also, I'd like to say thank you to another new subscriber. His name is Mr. Buzzkill, also known as Robert Jr. in Florida. Hey Robert, good to see ya. Well, welcome to Coffee with Tommy. I would like to say hello to all my current fans. There's Michelle Clement, Rosalind Clement, there is uh, Griff, and King Tyson 45. Thank you to everybody for being a fan of Coffee with Tommy. Well, what we're going to do this week is a little bit different. Seeing as how I can't really do much this week, I'm going to show you my skateboarding accident. And then we went out and we got a whole bunch of opinions on what I should do and what people think about my skateboarding. So, without further ado, I'm going to go into the clips. Here we go. Robert, you just saw my video. What's, what's on your mind? That spine has got to be hurting. <laughs> <laughs> we got to work on you. That back looks bad shape from that video. Dude, should I keep skateboarding or give it up? Keep going for it. Nice, thanks man. Andy, you saw the film. Yes. What's your opinion? I can't believe you didn't break your neck. I think you're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> should I stop skateboarding? I think you should stop skateboarding. Leave it to the kids. <laughs> <laughs> this is Alex, my buddy the butcher. Alex, you just saw the video. <laughs> you just show Frank, that is pretty bad. <laughs> oh my goodness, your neck's gotta be hurting. So what do you think, buddy? I need to lean forward, but that looks like it hurt pretty bad. So should I give up skateboarding? Uh, no, you shouldn't give it up. You should still stick to it. Just maybe, uh, maybe try grabbing. There you go. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> so, Sebastian, you just saw my skateboarding crash. What do you have to say about it? That was so cool. Do you think I should give up skateboarding? No. So what comments do you have for me, Mr. Gisa, about my skateboarding tricks? Well, my wife said you're stupid. <laughs> and she agrees with your wife. She said you're so stupid. I mean, as a family, with kids, and does all the stupid things. She thinks you're stupid. That's all what I can tell you. <laughs> what do you think, Mr. Gisa? I say the same thing. I mean, you should. <laughs> okay, Alan, you just saw the video of my skateboard crash. What do you got to say? I just thought it was one of the coolest crashes for a guy who still thinks he's 29 years old can get away with. It was a great crash. Keep up the good work. Thanks, Alan. I appreciate it. We also have a new mailbox section from our viewers. From anyone who wants to send me an email, leave it on YouTube, and we'll discuss it on future episodes. I have one here. It's from my brother in Colorado. His name is Joey. Dear Tom, my wife wants to know why you're such an idiot. Why don't you get a job and do something with your time? Thanks for all the fun, Joey. Wow. Well, this is back to you, Kendra. I'll tell you why, Kendra. Because life is short and you need to enjoy it. All work and no play makes Tommy a dull boy. So. That's the end of our mailbox for this week. If you have comments or questions you want to leave for me, leave them on the YouTube page. And back to more clips. All right, Polly Pocket slash Skittles. <laughs> you just saw the video of the skateboard crash. What's your, what do you got to say? 
that is a major epic fail and <laughs> that had got to hurt. <laughs> so what do you think I should do from here? Um, hmm, I don't know, what do you mean, like with skateboarding? Yeah. Um, hmm. Should I get back on the horse? I think so, just try not to uh, land on, you know, neck. Nico, you just saw my skateboarding crash. What do you have to say? That was so cool. Do you think I should give up skateboarding? No way. I love Led Zeppelin. Led Zeppelin rules. Sergio, what'd you think of my skateboard crash? It's super cool. It's sick. All right, Cole, you just saw my, uh, my skateboarding crash. What's your opinion? Tom, you are without a doubt the dumbest human being I've ever known. You need a BMW. <laughs> so Beverly, you just saw my skateboarding video. What'd you feel, what'd you think about that? Funny. Huh? I don't know what to say. I want to see it again, I've forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> now, what'd you guys think? There's a whole bunch of different opinions on what should happen. I'm not sure what I should do either but I think we're gonna find out. So, until next week, this will conclude episode number five of Coffee with Tommy. Thank you to everyone who's been involved. Bye. Well, I hope this answers your question on what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep on skating. <clears throat> Today's episode of Coffee with Tommy was brought to you by Sierra Fine Living Magazine. On the internet, sflmagazine.com. You can pick them up at your local retailers if you'd like to advertise Call Tom Patron at 916-548-3666. Again, Sierra Fine Living Magazine.